Well, last night, bands from high schools throughout Prince George's took over High Point High School's football field for the annual County Band Showcase. Our Monica McNutt was there and has more on the sights and sounds. Depending on who you ask, halftime of sporting events is the real showtime. That's when the bands take the field. But at the Prince George's County Band Showcase, no athletic teams were needed at all. The event has been around for decades. Prince George's County Instrumental Supervisor Lionel Harrell remembers performing in the showcase as a student at Northwestern High School. Now he's in charge. Some schools are known for marching bands, some schools are known for concert bands, so this is just another event that schools can showcase many different facets of their programs. Of the 22 high schools in the county, 15 performed, but for no reward. It's not a competition, it's a showcase so we can, so people can come out to watch and see, you know, different styles of marching, listen to different songs that the students have been working on. No official reward for winning, that is. Even though it's a showcase, on the side there's like a little, just a little, slight little competition. We just want to get out there and show the world what we have in Prince George's County. I think overall the one thing that brings us together of course is musicianship because we all have a love for the same thing but then when you see when you go against another school it's always that competitive feel to it. And as for that notion that band members aren't athletes? You spend many hours you know after school practicing um, you know you sweat just as much as any other sport probably more so you probably spend more time on the field than football yes I said it um, it's definitely an athletic event for sure. Some of the bands will go on to out-of-state competitions or even regional competitions, but for many of them, this was the only opportunity that they'll have to face some of their local county peers. Reporting from High Point High School, for CTV, Monica McNutt. The band from Charles Flowers is headed to North Carolina this weekend to compete with bands from up and down the East Coast. We wish them luck.